Let's look at another example of just how easy R makes some very difficult problems. R allows us to look up values very quickly without using a table. Here's the idea. We've got two populations here. One is the population of all applicants uh, who are taking an MCAT exam. We know that population is approximately normally distributed with a mean of 9.3. So there's the mean of 9.3 and a standard deviation of 2.3. The second population are those who get accepted to the medical school. The mean of that population is 10.1 with a standard deviation of 1.7. Now they ask us two questions here. <coughs> they say, what's the percent of all applicants that had a score greater than 13? The cool thing is that R has something that will tell us this brown area in that uh, population. We just need to ask for the p-norm of 13, 13, below 13, what's the probability below 13 in a mean of 9.3, 9.2 and a standard deviation of 2.3. So let's look at what R tells us there. Here I've already done that calculation in R. There I'm calculating See if you look down here. I'm calculating that brown area. But what I really want is the green area because they're asking us what percent of all applicants had a score higher than 13. So what I really need to do is take 1 minus that brown area. So that's going to give us this fraction. The fraction 0 0.0492. I need to change that to a percent. Remember, you change a fraction to a percent by moving the decimal places over, over two places, and there it is. Okay, let's look at the second one. In the second one, we're asking, uh, let me bring up my, my graph here. We want to know what the <coughs> probability is of getting a score between 8 and 11 for those, what percentage of the population is getting that score. <coughs> for those that are admitted to, uh, to medical school. So their mean is 10.1 and their uh, standard deviation is 1.7. So this brown area below 11 could be calculated and that would be too much because it includes this blue area as well. So I want to calculate that brown area minus that blue area. Let's look at uh, that R, we've done that real quickly. There's the, the brown area, the probability of getting a score of <coughs> uh, less than 11 in a mean of 10.1 and a standard deviation of 1.7, and then minus this other area, the probability of getting a score of, of 8 or less in a mean of 10.1 and a standard deviation of 1.7. Again, that gives us a fraction, which we have to change to a percent fraction is 0.5933795 and we just move the decimal place over two places and there it is and, and there's the correct answer. Okay, powerful stuff. That P norm and Q norm uh, completely eliminate the need for having to use uh, tables. It makes, uh, conceptually it makes uh, uh, statistics much, much easier.